recommendation from Tony Blair, Britain's former Prime Minister, said, Miles is honest, forthright and has impeccable taste. On a winter day in 2015, the Sherry's Co-op Board received an unusual application. A Chinese businessman calling himself Miles Guo wanted the most expensive unit in the building. The penthouse that occupies the entire 18th floor with six bedrooms, nine bathrooms and three terraces. There was no need to secure a mortgage. He could send $68 million in cash. Although Guo didn't know anyone at the Sherry who could vouch for him, his lawyers at prominent firms in Washington and New York delivered confidential documents that identified him as a married father of two who owned a Beijing real estate enterprise with assets of nearly $4 billion. He was number 74 on a list of China's richest people, but he avoided public attention and even basic photographs were scarce. A reference letter from RBS, the Swiss bank characterized him as a modest gentleman with a warm heart. He paid $43 million for a silver super yacht, Lady May, which had space to entertain 50 people and a living room that revolved on a cushion of compressed air. He socialized at Mark's Club, a member from the establishment, and traveled around town in a white Rolls Royce, handmade Louis Vuitton shoes, a rare variety of tea that he reportedly declared was worth a million dollars a kilo.